Okay, what's up YouTube? So in this video, we'll be talking about using the ivory tower for any, almost any low-life build or actually no, specifically in this video, a low-life righteous fire build. So I'll be talking about why would you rather have an ivory tower instead of a chevron's wrapping. So basically, if you're wondering, well, how is this a replacement? Does it prevent chaos damage? And yes, it does. It chaos damage is taken before ma is taken from mana before life so basically if you have mana chaos damage won't really be a problem to you so why would you use this over chevron's wrappings well first of all it provides two percent energy regeneration per uh, energy shield regeneration per second so if your builds needs vitalities i mean you know if it does this basically gives you vitality already pretty good and also, it has definitely lower base energy shield, but because of one of one of its effects, thirty plus max uh thirty percent, not thirty percent, thirty to maximum energy shield per one hundred percent reserve life. So definitely, as a low life build, you're gonna reserve life, and you're gonna you're gonna get energy shield from this. So by the way, for my personal build, I've tested. You know, I've tested both chest plates and personally, I got more energy shield from the Chevron's wrapping. But thanks to the 2% life regeneration, I can use Herod of Ash instead of Vitality, so that's more damage basically. And also if I'm not wrong, the Ivory Tower is generally cheaper, so this is like a more budget deal. And it looks nicer also, so yeah, that's my opinion. Okay, so... um. If you if you guys are curious, this is my skill tree. Nothing really interesting. Just ignore this. I'm just trying to get energy shield from this notes over here. Um yeah, that's basically it. Thanks for watching guys and see you next time.